Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. My name is Nav and today we are going to discuss a topic that's probably important for all Windows users out there. If you use a Windows laptop or a PC, there are a dozen of keyboard shortcuts that will make your regular tasks much easier. From copying folders to open the quick link menu, these shortcuts will help you speed different operations and boost the overall productivity. So in this video, we're going to introduce you to some of the most essential Windows keyboard shortcuts that will make it easier to perform various mundane tasks. But before going any further, make sure to hit that subscribe button if it's your first time on the channel. So first of all, let's understand why you would need shortcut keys on Windows PC or a laptop. The truth is that there are several operations that users perform on a daily basis, which are nothing but time consuming. Let's say you want to copy a file from a desktop to a different drive. If you were to follow the traditional copying methods, it would take several minutes to get the job done. But if you use the shortcut keys combinations, for example, Ctrl C and Ctrl V, it will speed up the entire process. Similarly, there are several other keyboard shortcuts for Windows that will make life more easier and help you get the job done from various tasks without any hassle. So let's quickly take a look at some of these keyboard shortcuts. Now for easy understanding, we have separated these keyboard shortcuts in four different categories. General shortcuts, file explorer shortcuts, Windows key keyboard shortcuts, and finally, command prompt shortcuts. So first up, general shortcuts. So let's start off with shortcuts that are extremely useful, but are also very common. So hopefully you should already know these. First up, Ctrl plus A. This is one of the most common Windows keyboard shortcuts. You can use this key combination to select an entire content at a particular folder or location. Next, Ctrl plus C. Again, you might have used this shortcut several times while copying content from one location to another on a Windows PC or laptop. This key combination will copy a selected item to your clipboard. Next, Ctrl plus V. Again, this is used to paste the content that you pre copied previously to a dedicated location. Ctrl plus D. When you want to delete an item from your PC, simply select it and press Ctrl plus D on your keyboard. However, this won't permanently delete the file, only transfer it to the recycle bin. Next, Shift plus DEL, Dell which is delete. Unlike the previous key combination, Shift plus Dell will permanently delete the selected fr file from your PC. This means you won't be able to recover the deleted file, so use it with caution. Alt plus Tab. So when you've opened up multiple apps and windows, often it becomes challenging to navigate between them. In this case, Alt plus Tab will help you switch between different apps easily. Windows key plus E will help you directly open the file explorer without having to double click my computer on your desktop. Windows key plus PRTSC, which stands for print screen. This is one of the useful Windows keyboard shortcuts that save you a lot of time when you want to capture a screenshot. You simply press Windows plus print screen and this will automatically click a screenshot and save it inside your pictures folder. Next up is File Explorer Shortcuts. Once you're in the Windows Explorer, you can use various key combinations to perform different tasks. First up, Ctrl plus F. So if you want to search a specific item inside the current folder, press Ctrl plus F and you'll automatically be prompted to the search box at the top right hand corner. Alt plus D will highlight the address bar so you, now you can use this key combination to find a specific location using its address. Ctrl plus W, so instead of dragging the cursor all the way up to the close button, Ctrl plus W will directly close the current window. With Alt plus Enter, you can quickly open the properties windows for the selected item. Ctrl plus Shift plus N, this key combination will create a new folder in the current directory. Using this shortcut, you won't have to create a folder from the menu bar as it's instantly created within a few seconds. Next up, Windows Keyboard Shortcuts. There are several keyboard shortcuts in Windows 10 that work with Windows Key. So let's take a look at a few of these shortcuts that might help you in your daily life. First up, Windows Key. 
Press the Windows key quickly to bring the Start menu. That's probably the easiest way to launch the Start menu in a Windows laptop PC. Windows key plus A, so Windows 10 comes with a dedicated action center where you can change different preferences. So you can launch the action center instantly by pressing Windows plus A. Windows plus D. This keyboard shortcut will be pretty useful when you want to check something on the desktop. Instead of minimizing all the windows, simply press Windows plus D to go to your desktop. And when you press it again, you'll promptly be back to your previous window again. Windows plus C will launch Microsoft's own voice assistant, Cortana. Finally, we've got Command Prompt shortcuts. So if you use Command Prompt, the next key combinations will be extremely helpful for you. Control plus F in Command Prompt will bring up the dedicated CMD search box. You can use the Control plus up and down arrow keys to move the screen either one line up or one line down. Page up and page down keys will help you move the cursor up and down through the lines you've written in the command prompt window. Pressing Ctrl plus end will scroll you to the end of the screen. And finally, Ctrl plus home key combination will automatically scroll you to the top of the screen. So guys, these were the key combinations that will help you in your daily life and perform different operations without wasting time. Although there are many other Windows keyboard shortcuts out there, they might not be useful in one's life. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a like and leave a comment down below. And if you've been finding our videos useful so far, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for future updates. Take care guys.